Hi Aquarius and Cross Watchers, this is Abna from Soulmate Terra and today we are doing your feelings and their feelings love spread um, for October 2019 to find out the mutual feeling towards two people and now please keep in mind that these are general messages if they resonate with you please like and subscribe to the channel also do check your moon your rising and your venus signs because they're extremely important when it comes to relationship tarot um but if the if the messages don't resonate with you um just let them go let them go they're not meant for you so those messages are for someone else just take good advice from it all right uh, uh, I'll be using this deck to express your feelings, uh, Morgan Greer, and I would use um, the Radiant Wise Tarot, uh, the traditional um, um, Rider Waite Tarot to express the feelings of the person who is connecting with you uh, in the month of October 2019. Let's get started. I don't know, I'm holding your card is giving me a feeling of excitement. Maybe some of you are um, excited in your relationship, having some sort of exciting news when it comes to your relationship. That's just my intuition which I just had. Tarot could be completely different. Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Why everyone is not ready or willing to work on their relationships? You, you, you've given up. You're not putting in the effort required to make this relationship work because it's, it's burdensome for you. It's it's giving you a lot of burden, and um, you you have like given up. You're not putting any effort, any more effort into this relationship because um, you think it's it's troubling you. It's giving you a lot of um, I would say headache uh, a lot of problems a lot of issues you you don't want to maybe there is something else maybe you want to focus on something else but right now you are not uh, focused on this relationship you're not putting in any effort in this relationship let's see Of the other person is also thinking they've taken um, maybe this person loves you a lot this person loves you a lot and despite the fact that you you have given up on them they're not willing to give up on you they're still making a decision they're trying to keep calm they're trying to uh, keep their head and their heart in, in one place and take a decision uh, you know how to tackle with the situation you guys are in or if the situation is going in the wrong direction they're thinking about different things but at the same time they're thinking about you that means they, they love you they love you but they, they're going to make a decision um, if, if you're not um, if you are back out um, they're going to make a decision soon. I just heard the word burdensome. Could be burdensome relationship for you guys. I don't know. Or maybe burdensome for the other person. Nine of Cups in reverse. While well, they are trying to make a decision uh, whether how to mend this relationship or how to move in a direction which will um, give clarity, they are trying to clear their mind and they are trying to clear their head. Uh, at the same time, you are like reckless. 
honestly you, you're not putting any effort in this relationship and you're being very very reckless Hmm. You, you're not willing to put in any in, in, uh, effort in this um, Knight of Cups uh, for me is in reverse is some sort of person who is not um, honest someone who's very di uh, disloyal someone who's very you know dishonest in the in the relationship um, they might be you know some some of you could be thinking about other person uh, like I said, excitement, maybe you're excited about having someone else in your life, could be that. But this is, this is something that you, you, don't, you are cooking a, a situation, creating a relationship which is not trustworthy for both parties. of cups so you are being reckless you are being untrustworthy you are being disloyal however the other person is very loyal to you they love you they love you a lot like i said before they love you a lot but yet at the same time they are despite their loyalty their loving nature uh, their empathetic nature where uh, you know they sense what if something is going wrong with you they are also protecting their cup of love if you see this queen of cups she's holding her cup in a position which is and staring at it the cup is closed she is holding it firmly she's willing to offer but she will not offer it to someone who's not worth it they're guarding their emotions they're guarding their emotions yet they love you a lot you are disloyal but they are very loyal and numbing ah, that's interesting so you just Oh, sorry. I don't know why I said Sagittarius. Although they, none of these cards are related to being Sagittarius. Maybe some of you are, are connecting with Sagittarius. Either way, this is a Cancerian, Pisces. Could be any of the sign as well. Knight of Swords in reverse. Two knights in a row. Two knights who are disloyal to, to their core. Two knights who are reckless, who never think twice about uh, taking a decision. The Knight of uh, Swords here, it's like, hmm, you're ruining this relationship. You're being so picky you're being so arrogant that um it's affecting your relationship it's affecting your relationship and you're willing to just you know make that happen why do that to someone who loves you a lot someone who's very loyal Fun, someone who's very passionate someone who wants to be in your life someone who wants to rush in and help you this is someone who actually really loves you and true love is very difficult to find and there is passion there is loyalty there is love yet you're making them make a decision about something because your behavior is not in line you don't seem to be in this relationship anymore but this person this person is head over heels in love with you yet they're holding themselves back they're holding themselves back because of your behavior but do remember they are very loyal loving and passionate about you guys all right i'll see you guys next month love you have a nice october Bye.